All right, guys, we'll go right into questions for tight end Elijah Royal. Can you tell us uh, how you're doing physically and how your journey to recovery is going? Uh, you know, I'm doing well. Uh, I mean, we've we've been doing a great job, you know, with the uh, with the training staff, and you know, I'm I'm ready. I'm ready to be out there. Do you have uh, any any restrictions? No, I'm good to go. I'm good. Feeling good. We saw that you didn't you weren't uh, doing drills today. Is that just what is that? Uh, yeah, I've, I've been all over the place working with the O line, working with you know the tight ends, the receivers, just you know being out there coaching. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm I'm good. What was the the recovery process like for you? Just any time stuff on you, not just physically, but you know mentally and stuff too. Uh, you know, I gave myself a, a day to be mad about it, and then you know after that, I was like, you know, I got to attack this rehab so I can come back healthy as possible. You know. Just, I want to be feeling better than I than I felt before, and I feel like I'm doing a good job with that. What kind of injury was it? ACL. ACL. Yeah. Yes, sir. Just a day. It took. That's pretty good. Yeah, yeah. I, I gave myself a day to be mad about it. Yeah. Do you think you'll have to play in a brace this season, or is that only a fall season? Uh, it just depends on how I'm feeling. We'll we'll see when uh when we get there. How's it been so far? Brian? It feels good. Yeah, leg feels good. What are your goals for? Utilization in this offense, and just how it's kind of opened up the tight end uh -huh. abilities. Yeah, I, I feel good about the offense. You know, it, it gives us a chance to you know show out, uh, really do do whatever we want. You know, pass game, run game. It gives us more freedom. You know, so I I, I really like that. How is Tyler? How has he come along? With your relationship with him? Oh, my my relationship with him is great. Uh, you know, I'm I'm glad he's comfortable with the offense. So uh, that was really my main my main concern. As long as he's comfortable, as long as he's good, you know, we're good, really. With Will in the NFL now, uh, there's obviously a lot of a lot of tight end snaps up for, up for grabs. And what's the competition like in the room between you, know, you and Cam and all the freshmen? Oh, it was great. I mean, we're all we're all competing. You know, they make me better, I make them better. Uh, we're all competing for that number one spot. So uh, yeah, it's, it's good to have them push me. I push them. What do you? What are you seeing so far in the freshmen, Riley and Jackson? Oh, they're great. I mean, I think, you know, Jackson, you know, he's a real hardworking guy. He's, he just started playing football, so that's it's, it's real impressive to me, you know, watching him play, do what he does. And then we got Riley. Uh, yeah, he, he, he can do it all. I, I think he's going to be real good in the future. Do you feel like you'll get an opportunity in this bigger role this year for you to show your abilities as a downfield pass catcher? Yeah, absolutely, yeah. Yeah, I, I think I'll get a chance to showcase that. I think uh, I think Mario Cristobal will talk about you. You came to the spring game, right? What, did you fly in or to the spring uh, game? Yeah. Uh, no, the spring game was down here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So but I, I didn't know if um, I thought maybe you flew in somewhere. Oh, the yeah, I had uh, me and my dad. We had flew into the uh, Georgia Tech game. We had flew into Atlanta. We had went watched the game. Uh, what was that like for you? You know, it was great, you know, just seeing my teammates out there, you know, before, after the game, just seeing them happy to see me there. You know, it, it, it was a great experience. I saw that you were around for pro day, um, so just to kind of see Will Mallory, um, you know, take that step to the NFL, mm -hmm. how much more confidence did that kind of instill in you that you are in steps you're going to take that next step following Mallory? I mean, yeah, Will's my guy. But, I mean, it, it's just motivation, you know? If he can do it, I can do it. It just motivates me, makes me want to work harder, makes me want to, you know, follow his footsteps. And, you know, he, he pretty much did everything right. So, you know, just he left the blueprint out for me. So everything that, that he did, you know, I'm going to try to do. Do you ever ask him for advice or talk to him? So? Yeah, all the time. Yeah, yeah, that's my guy. Yeah, we talk all the time. And he's, he's willing, right? Yeah, he's doing well, yeah. How much bigger are you this year? A few more. Uh, I'm about the same size, but you know I've I've been in the weight room, you know, trying to you know turn that uh, the body fat into muscle. 245. What are you? Yeah, I'm right now. I'm this morning. I was 253, 254. Yeah. Is there a part of your game this season that you're really hoping to put on display to, uh, to improve on? Uh, yeah, I think you know I, I want to showcase my run after catch, that and uh, the deep balls. Yeah. Does it almost feel to you like? Your career is just kind of starting right now, even though you've been here for a little bit. I mean, it feels like I've been been here for a while now, but uh, yeah, so like it does. Now you kind of have a chance to really bust out. Yeah, know? yeah. Mm hmm. I was there. Having a you know, better, better presence like Cam McCormick in the room, just what is the add to a tight end? You know, he adds knowledge, you know. 
I mean, he, he pretty much knows everything. He knows all the run game stuff, all the pass game stuff. You know, he, he's dialed in. You know, he's, he's been in college football for a while. So it's great to be able to, you know, take from him and, uh, you know, him uh, be there to uh, help me lead the group. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.